Hello there. Welcome. My name is Sunkis. Are you ready to learn? <laughs> Learning can be so much fun. Today, we are going to look at vertebrates. Have you ever heard about vertebrates? Well, this video will show you the five amazing classes of vertebrates. Firstly, let me explain to you what a vertebrate is. Vertebrates are animals who have an articulated spine column, which is also called a skeleton or a backbone. This supports the animal's body and allows it to move. Now, can you think of any animal with a backbone? Now hold this thought and let's get to the rest of the video. Keep that animal in mind and see if you were correct at the end of the video. Let's look at the five classes of vertebrates. First, we have mammals. Mammals are warm-blooded vertebrates. They feed their babies milk and they have either hair or fur. Dogs, zebras, cats, lions, and humans are mammals. Fish are cold-blooded vertebrates. They live in water. They breathe through gills and they have scales and fins. Stingray, goldfish, and sharks are fish. However, whales, dolphins, and jellyfish do not fall into this group or class of vertebrates. Next, we have amphibians. These are cold-blooded vertebrates. They live on land and in water, and they have moist, smooth skin. Toads, frogs, and newts belong to this class of vertebrates. Birds are warm-blooded vertebrates. They lay eggs and they have feathers, two legs, wings, and a beak. The scarlet ibis, coquico, penguin, and ostrich belong to this class of vertebrates. Last, but certainly not least, we have reptiles. Reptiles are cold-blooded vertebrates. They lay eggs and they have scales. Snakes and alligators are reptiles. I think I may have a little problem. This is so hard to remember. There must be an easier way. Hmm, let me think. Ah, I think I've got it. I think I've got an idea. My favorite animal bodies represents M F A B R. Come on, say it with me. You can do it. Let's get this. My favorite animal bodies represent. One more time. That's excellent. I think we've got it. No? If it is, you've got it. Let me try something. Are you ready? Okay, let's go. What class of vertebrates does a horse fall into? If you said mammal, excellent. Let's try another one. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. If you said bird, excellent. One more. This is a lizard. What class? If you said a reptile, you've got it. Oh, well done. Excellent work. Thank you for stopping by and learning about the vertebrates, the five classes of vertebrates. I had a great time with you. Goodbye now. Take care.